This morning, mounting disbelief over these photos and cell phone video. They show a pair of white police officers on horseback in Galveston, Texas, walking a handcuffed black man they've just arrested to a staging area using a rope. There's no excuse by the way they treated my brothers. No excuse. The family of 43-year-old Donald Neely says he suffers from mental illness, is homeless, and has had multiple encounters with police over the years. He was arrested for misdemeanor trespassing. What they did was real inhumane. It was real degrading. I, they treated my brother as he was a dog. At a rally last night, the community urged police for more than just an apology. When they dragged Donald Neely down that road by horses and rope, it was like they were dragging our entire community down the road. Galveston's African-American police chief apologized to Neely in a statement calling the arrest an unnecessary embarrassment, adding that while the officers followed a trained technique, the department is immediately banning its use. I have to learn from it. My agency has to learn from it. And I commit to you that we will do better. No disciplinary action has been taken against the two officers. Neely's family wants them fired. The picture that it paints for anybody who has studied or seen any references to slavery, I think that's why it's so appalling to everyone. Online, seething comments about the images. Not a lick of common sense or human decency tweeted one user. This man is not your slave or your boy, wrote another.